first. Today I'm going to go teach you a little something different. I'm going to teach you how to create that following sound that you just heard. I'm going to try and replicate it as close as I can as possible. So, you're going to open up Audacity. If you don't know how to get to that, you're just going to go into Google here and type in Audacity free download. Click on that. And click on where it says Audacity source sourceforge.net. And whatever computer you have, you're going to download that version of that this software. You're going to download that, install it, all that fun shit. Um, and you also want to go in and also install, if you actually want to save this um, sound wave, you're also going to look up Audacity Lame. Lame download Windows 7, or like I said, whatever thing you have. You're going to look for this. And you want to download. Yeah, you want to download Lame MP3 encoder, while it's actually export MP3 files. You want to download that too. And then you just go ahead and you install that too. And that enables you to save your files. Because if you don't have that, you can't save them as that, as an MP3. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and kind of, so I already have something recorded here. If it will play. So when you're doing um, Quake's voice, you want to do like a gasping kind of feel like like what this has like it's almost like he's gasping but he's also talking at the same time and you're gonna want to duplicate that three times duplicate this again in this first one you're gonna name plus 12 pitch I'm going to tell you why you're going to name these, why you're naming these, when I get to it. And name this negative 12 pitch. <clears throat> you're going to make this negative, tw negative 24 pitch. Okay. And then you want to click on this one and then duplicate that as well so now you should have two negative 12 pitches up here and the reason you're naming these is because you're gonna bring the pitch of this up to 12 so we basically what you have to do is go to effect change pitch and then where it says semitones half steps type in 12 you can click preview too I'm gonna do that So I get that kind of sound. Make sure the output volume is all the way up so you, like, so you can really hear it if it's soft, because this is going to soft. Then you're going to change that to negative 12. Just get something like this. Get something like that. Now I'll kind of show you what it sounds like after I'm done changing the pitch, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna add a, we're going to be adding a lot more than just the pitches to make it really give it that effect that the original one had. <clears throat> because remember, Quake is more of a monster than a human, because he's human at first, but then he becomes a monster, basically. So we want to change the pitch on this too. Okay, click these little lines right here, which means you want to merge it or you want to create what you're creating. And now you want to hit play again so you know what it sounds like. And I'm going to bring this up a little bit on all of these so you can really hear it. Plus four. Plus four. 
plus four. No, it's just no, it's. She should get something that kind of sounds like that. Try something here. Let's try this. So that sounds similar. Yes, I see that. Oh, no, I know why. Because you have to, yeah, you're gonna have to slow it down. You're gonna have to save the actual audio once it's all done. You're gonna have to slow it down even more than it already is to really get that vibe. Now I'll show you how to do that too. Basically, well, I'm not gonna jump ahead. I'm just gonna kind of do what I have to do now. So now. You want to go to the plus 12, you want to go to effect, echo, give that a point 3, point 2, preview. Negative 24 is the one you really want to focus on with the effects. <clears throat> go to reverb and for you're gonna do room size 70 let me, actually let me preview this first yeah so room size 73 pre delay 144 reverberance 77 damping 54 tone low 30 tone high 30 wood gain negative 2 dry gain 2 stereo width 90 to 95 you just hit, hit ok that changes it. And then you want to go to this effect. You want to give this a little bit of reverb, but not too much. So we bring this down to about half of that. So down to about 50. Bring this down to about 85. Bring that down twice, so 55. And then let's review this again. This one, you need to have some echo too. Effect, echo, point five, point three, actually point five, point seven. Let's try that. Seven. Try that. Nope, too much. Point two. Three. Actually, point. Let's do it inverted like that. Click OK. You're gonna want to get this one other effect, but not a lot. You're not gonna, you're not gonna really get this one too much effects. Phaser, and that should be about right for this stage two dry wet 128. Point four frequency start phase zero depth 100. Okay. Move the sliders around a little bit too. The negative 24 one is going to stay about in the middle. I'm going to move this over, move that over this way, and then move the last one over a little slight, slightly, like so. Bring this, bring this one down a little bit. Bring this one down just a bit. Bring that one down, about midway. 
Let's try this again. Usually it's something that sounds kind of like that. So I think for this part we're good. And now we're going to go ahead, file, export, and export it as Quake Talk. Or just Quake, whatever. If it's just, if it's just a sound, Quake sound, Quake breathing, whatever. Um, you want to double click that, or double click so it gets a talk, and you, you know, highlight this, copy, save, double click again. Control V will paste it. Okay. Exit out of this. So that should be saved. I want to open this back up. Okay. File open. And then you want to open this back up. And hit it. And you want to do the same negative 12, negative 24, but you're going to do negative 12 first. Preview. Okay. Change push again. I actually think it was change speed for the other one. I'm not sh exactly sure. Let me try that. That sounds about right. Yeah, it's not, that sounds just about right. So let's. I'm gonna go ahead and open up this other one too. Uh, so this should sound fairly close. So you should have something that sounds almost like that now. Um, it's pretty much how you create the voice. Um, but if you have any further questions or you want to video chat me or whatever, just feel free to go ahead and add me on Facebook or on Skype. Um, I will leave my I will leave my Skype username in the link below in the description below, um, along with the links to get to those sites. But uh, this is Black Eagle signing off.